let's go hello everyone welcome back to another video on the enchanted basin if you're new here hi i'm jenny it is very nice to meet you i like to do videos that are halloween or witchy oriented vegan taste test craft with me videos and chronic illness awareness chats shout out to all my fellow spoonies yes we are moving um because today we are on the move for old time pottery we went to at home i didn't even end up filming it because uh there was nothing there it said there would be some on the website. It showed like 15 different items in stock. Nothing there. So today, old time pottery, fingers crossed. This is my, not my local one. I'm actually visiting family right now. So I thought I would check theirs out and see if there's anything for my Tennessee ghouls. <sighs> Craig's here with me, by the way. So we'll, we'll see what we can see. See you guys inside. <laughs> Part two. There's only a couple of things, so some leaf, little bats. Well, they're looking very blue on the camera. It's, yeah, it's, very purple. It's very, it's very purple. Orange wreath. They had these last year. Um, cat. They had those last year as well. So everything looks like it's kind of last year stuff. The little pop it's the poppy. <laughs> yes, the poppers. By the way summer stuff but look at all this black and white striped patio furniture cushions super cool not sure about the pricing on those but check it out trees again oh, glitter um so really say the price on it. glitter be prepared to be glitter bombed that's all i'm gonna say pumpkins these are like little wooden and uh um, thicker or no they're like uh, uh what's that burlap material sack. burlap yeah there you go Burlap <laughs> More tinsel y things. That. Ghosts. Black and whites. All those stuff so far. See any stuff from last year. All of the banners. Some different little. These are like styrofoam balls called, covered in glitter. Little garlands. Um. Oh, I remember this from last year too, actually. We oh, have... This, this is last year? Yep. These gnomes. I actually think I might have gotten one of these. Possibly. And then we have a couple... Pumpkins. Happy Halloween. One with a gnome. Oh, I think this actually lights up. Well, probably has a little thing in it. To oh, yeah, it. yeah, it says a... That's okay. Should I pull it out? Man? Nah, don't worry about it. Then some black and white polka dot pumpkins. I don't think that's. And that's, that's it. it so far for the explicitly Halloween stuff. Let me show. Oh, look. A couple pillows. One's a black cat. It looks kind of like a, um, almost like cross stitch kind of texture. Cat. Here for the booze, trick or treat, Halloween, flying bats, black cats, candy corn. I believe in the great pumpkin. Oh my gosh, yes. This is a nightmare. Goblins, ghosts, and ghouls. It's right, you people. Black cat. I want to show you guys. I'll have to walk back there. There's a gargoyle in the garden stuff. Let's go hunt for it. In the mesh, they're actually starting, they have some orange and some black and white striped. So it's just black. This is really Halloween-y. I mean, you know, my little pony Halloween. <laughs> 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 and then they like, they've obviously just all the colors of the rainbow. But I thought I would mention that for any people who like to make wreaths. This might be a good place to kind of stock up on some supplies. Okay, so they have a bunch of different garden statues. We totally get these angels, make them a little creepy with some some moss, or maybe even paint them. Um, let's see. <laughs> Yoga frog, eagle, bunch of different ones. Bunny, gator. <laughs> but look, look at these two. Oh my gosh. These gargoyles are pretty amazing. 
How much are they? Oh my God, these are heavy. These are $60, but they're extremely heavy. So if you're looking for one, do a spooky pelican. Kitty. Pop. Oh, a gator football player, rugby player. Um, another angel. <laughs> Bloated frog, you know. So, a lot of options. I feel like you he's could play full. around. He, yeah, he's very full. I feel like you could play around with this stuff and kind of do some oh, spooky, like this one. spooky stuff. Oh, is that yeah, it's the gargoyles. Those are pretty cool. Okay, so they have some of the mailbox covers and that kind of stuff like they did last year. Gnome. Kitties, I love this. is a little bit more fall than straight up Halloween, but they do have some cute designs. I'll say last year I bought our little Halloween flag that we have. I got it here. Yeah, right now this looks like all fall ones. I like these, this pumpkin one. Look at this. That's mm. totally extra <laughs> Halloween-y. <laughs> but yeah, 100% Halloween. Gnomes for, for gnome people. <laughs> More gnomes. Okay. Um, oh, one thing I wanted to show you guys. I saw that they had some like tiki stuff, like luau kind of things. I think if you're someone, if you're someone who likes to do like spooky, I don't know, tiki kind of situation or kind of retro, I could see maybe making some of these Halloween looking. I think a lot of this stuff is on sale too. So you could always like add some little bats to it, change the color on this kind of stuff. Tiki houses. Oh. I think, oh Jesus. I think you could definitely like make this look a little bit more spooky with some of these. I don't know, I, thought, I saw it and I kind of thought some of you guys could definitely play around with it. I don't know, I'm definitely starting to look more into like what can you get that could have been another season and get it, you know? I think that's an interesting way to repurpose some things and get, get a good deal. Are you things. recording? Oh my gosh. Guys, ruined. Ooh. Oh, this is cute. Okay, I'm gonna turn it around because you have to see. Look at this little solar thing. This is very much like little fairy house. This too, this is actually really adorable. You could totally paint this to be, I don't know, a little bit darker if you wanted, or if you were doing a whole like um, forest witch, garden witch kind of theme. <gasps> this is like actually really beautiful. That's so cool. Let's see how much this one is. $19.99, so $20. And I don't know if this stuff is on sale yet, but if you can get that one on sale, it's actually really pretty. That's what we see so pumpkins far. Over there. Pumpkins? Like oh look. There's pumpkin guys. Oh, here. oh my gosh, I miss so much you all. What would I do without Craig? I would have just walked past all of this. Look at this right at the door. I completely missed it when we walked in. This one's new. They didn't have this one last year. It's little it's like these little ones where you can move their arms. They light up, but this is like a little pumpkin witch one. Let me see if it'll, the tester will work. Nope. <laughs> Ooh, that actually looks really cool. These are, these are $20. It's actually a little, a little expensive for this kind of material. They make these kind of things Dollar Tree. They don't light up, but they look cool. Skull one, multiple colors. That's cool. You have, so yeah, last year again, they had black and white. They had red and black. There's gray. Ooh, this one's eyes are a little bit different. Let's see if that one will light up. Nope. Nope. <laughs> that was the thing last year. Half of the little trimies did not work. Ghost, it looks like it's seven feet long. It's a very, very long ghost. Oh, and they have our skeleton. <laughs> there was a, yes, the mermaid. <laughs> I remember this last year. Oh, she's feeling a hot mess. She is, she is feeling her hair today, friends. 
What if that's a dude mermaid? I mean, okay, they are feeling themselves. <laughs> I'll say that. Whomever they are, they are feeling themselves. And then, freak, freaky fabric, not creepy cloth. Is that what it was last year? Creepy well, cloth? Well, no, at Dollar Tree, it's creepy cloth. Oh. So here, it's freaky fabric, I guess. Good old um, alliteration. You can kind of see there's some pumpkins with letters on them. Again, they had those last year as well. Not a huge showing right now, but hey, y'all, it's, it's something. We actually went to an at-home earlier because online said there was a bunch of stuff in the store. There was nothing. There was a bunch of boxes in the back of the store. So... Looks like they're working on it. Anyway, we're rambling. Yeah, so at least there's something. Um, definitely be checking your old time pottery because they're stocking it slowly but surely. So, yes, it's warm. It's like eight o'clock at night and it's still like 80 degrees. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this. Hopefully next video we'll find a little bit more, but at least it's a start, especially for not expecting to find this at all today. So woohoo. Give this video a big ol' thumbs up. Subscribe if you aren't already because I am gonna be doing these check-ins at least once a week all the way up until Halloween. So you don't wanna miss anything. Um, but yeah, hope you guys are doing wonderful and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>